bad. My wife is working in her room writing, and I've come in three times with idle chatter, some not new news news. The fourth time she identifies me as what I am, a man lost in late afternoon in the terrible in-between, good work long over, a good drink not yet what the clock has okayed. <laughs> Her mood a little bemused, leave me the hell alone mixed with a weary smile. And I see my face up on the post office wall among men least wanted, <laughs> looking forlorn. In the small print under my name, annoying to loved ones in the afternoons, <laughs> lacks inner resources. I go away, guilty as charged, and write this poem, which I insist she read at drinking time. She's reading it now. It seems she's pleased, but when she speaks, it's about charm and how predictable I am, how when in trouble, I try to become irresistible, like one of those blonde dogs with a red bandana around his neck. <laughs> Sorry he's peed on the rug. <laughs> Forget it, she says, this stuff is old, it won't work anymore. And I hear, good boy, good boy. <laughs> and can't stop licking her hands. 